Hello everybody, thanks for tuning in on my channel. Welcome, I'm Pat coming to you from the north part of Belgium and uh, in several videos back I talk about that we're gonna bring you uh, new videos, new kind of videos, random videos. So I'm not only talking about pipe and tobacco, uh, YTPC and uh, uh, Team Freedom Matters, but we're making videos uh, about metal detecting um, that we going into nature well and a lot more so but uh, first I'm smoking my Hilson made in Belgium pipe and this uh, smooth pipe is more than 30 years old so this is one of the last pieces that I make in Belgium uh, and it, they they are really smoking good but uh, unfortunately uh, the, the people who make uh, this pipes don't make it anymore in Belgium uh, they make Hilson uh, they still making Hilson but uh, they are made now by a good friend of mine uh, and that's uh, the pipe factory uh, the owner of the pipe factory Goebbels so the Dutch uh, pie factory gobbles and uh, well they are the same quality that they make now and yeah I, but but this is something special because they made it in Belgium and uh, when you smoke or you can smoke something from your own country uh, that's always better than uh, you know you know what I mean anyway in it is the uh, one of, uh, of the, the blends that I smoke uh, a lot and that's the Niala from HU tobacco and in it is the uh, I always forget what's in it it's a red Virginia we have uh, Havana leaves in it Perique uh, Burley and uh, Brazil leaves so this one is not a, uh, a blend to smoke very early in the morning on a empty stomach but when you smoke one or two pipes of this uh, you got enough for a couple of hours so anyway so as I mentioned in several videos back we're gonna bring you uh, a, a different kind of videos and one of uh, the videos that we're gonna bring you is that we're gonna use again uh, trail cams um, we're gonna put trail cams on well several locations here in my neighborhood in the forest and we're going to start with it uh, when fall is coming. Now, why we start with it when fall is coming? Well, it's uh, at this moment everything uh, there is. We have a lot of leaves on the trees, and when there is some wind, uh, then uh, the devices are going to recording, and you're going to recording only the wind who's uh, moving the, the leaves. So we have to wait till uh, till um, fall to have the possibility to capture something on a trail cam. Now the only problem we have here is that um, they build everything very close together, and our roads uh, are a disaster. So <clears throat> when we want to put a, uh, a a trail cam. In a forest we must do that very carefully because when they see if there is a, a trail cam some people want to destroy it or steal it or whatever we don't have so much places that you got there in the United States where no people are coming now I just was watching the, uh, the video from Piper Dave uh, in Wyoming and he's captured regular uh, wildlife there so it's beautiful to see those animals living in the wild. Now, we don't have that kind of wildlife here in Belgium. We got some wolves. Uh, they are really coming back from, from Holland, Germany. And we have some wolves here in the area. But uh, most of the, those animals being killed by cars. So that's what I say. They build everything so close together here. So the, the, the animals don't have any space 
that they have in the United States or in other countries. And uh, that's the only, well, let's say, really uh, wildlife that we have here. I, I never see one in the wild, but uh, there are some around uh, my area here. So let's hope that we can capture uh, some wolves on, on the trail cams, but anyway. So, which one we're going to use? Well, I have three of them, and uh, they are uh, in three different colors. And why three different colors? Well, we have a lot of different trees where we're going to put them on, and uh, we really have to see, uh, we, we, we must hang them up on a tactical way so that people don't see if there is a uh, trail cam. Now the first one is a green one. This one has a enormous night view, so it's great to use it at night. Uh, the only problem is that uh, the lights here, <clears throat> they're black, they're black lights, but you can see it when, when he's uh, observing something and he's uh, film it, you're going to see the lamps lighting up. So that's not good, but it's a really good one to use in the dark. Uh, <clears throat> the second one uh, is a little darker, so we use this one on trees and uh, we hang them quite high up uh, uh, with, with the lens down below to the, the ground. But he's uh, uh, how I must say, he's, uh, when something is moving, he's recording it. So we have to put it on a place when there is some wind, if there is no movements, because but every movement he's uh, going to film it. And this one here, it's uh, American made, it's a Bushnell. Uh, uh, it's an American uh, trail cam. And I use this one uh, at home here. So every, <clears throat> sorry, every winter, we put, uh, we set up a, an observation and feeding station for the birds. So I can monitoring uh, which kind of birds are coming, uh, coming here uh, on our apartment. So it's it's not big <clears throat> where we can set up the the feeding station, but. I can observe which kind of birds are coming and I can tell uh, by the images that they are healthy or not. So those three uh, trail cams we're going to use the coming uh, months and of course uh, we're going to share that with you uh, in, uh, in my videos. So for those who are interested in what's going on in nature here in Belgium be my guest to watch the videos. So, uh, well, that's what I have to say in this one. Um, I'm uh, a few days uh, away from my pension, so I'm going to have a lot of time to uh, doing this kind of stuff, making videos. Uh, going to see that uh, we find tactical places where we can put the cams down and so on and so on. So I had a lot of ideas and uh, I'm gonna love it to share that with you all. So that's what I have to say. I'm gonna light up my pipe again. And uh, my old boy got it as a present from my wife so thank you very much I'm very happy with it. it is a good lighter it works every time so uh, well that's what I have to say I'm still watching every video of you um, I have just one question it's a long time ago that I uh, saw a video coming up from uh, trucking Piper Doug if there is anybody, anybody who knows what's going on with Doug, please let me know in the comments section. Um, I, I miss him. 
I, I always watching his videos, but it's a long time ago that I saw a video from him. I, I, the last thing that I was knowing from him was that he was going back to the hospital. There was something going on with him. And after that, I, I didn't see a video anymore from him. So please, if anybody out there knows what's going on with uh, Piper, uh, trucking Piper dog, please let me know. And uh, let's hope uh, the best that everything is okay with him. So, okay, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, take care, be safe wherever you are. And uh, as Uncle Willie say, I got one of these too. Uh, and sometimes he, it's not working. So the same, wait a second. The same what Uncle Willie is doing. Wake up.